Welcome back to the channel. Let's explore together. Today, we're checking out someone who titled the vi their video, Rick Rolling All of YouTube with a Paid Ad. This is from the Tech It realm. This was recommended by YouTube. Uh, I'm all for this. I'm imagining he bought a Google AdSense space and put, uh, you know, the Rick Roll on it. But I don't know how he did that with copyright laws. So I'm very curious. Let's see what we got. Here we go. Today, I'm going to be rickrolling all of YouTube Perfect. with a single paid advertisement. And yes. how we're going to be doing this is we're going to be going to Google AdWords, and then we're going to be making a new ad. Now, hopefully this actually works out correct, because if it does and everything goes to plan, this just might be something that no man has ever done before. I'm very happy to be the first. And we're going to be trying you to make it. the ad as long as possible. You live, you live your dreams, sir. We're all here for you. We, we want you to be able to rickroll the whole of the world possible before people could click the skip button this way they have to endure the rick roll for as long as what we can make them it's definitely going to be worth it and now this is the time of the video where i tell you to make the red button two inches below the screen gray if it is indeed red this way you could be updated on the regular for your normal dose of new stupid ideas like this all right guys i'm going to show you how to do this you do this and you hit this i want you to follow those instructions and do that on my channel as well right at this moment go get it this one all right, so I guess this is how companies do it. If companies actually, like, wanted to rickroll everyone on YouTube. Of course. Because that's a great way to spend your money. Yes. So start now, or you can call this number. Well, we could rickroll the person on the other end of the number, but it's probably just a robot because knowing Google and everything- Google doesn't hire people, bro. Thing like that. Uh, I guess if we just start with a brand new account, why is this saying- <laughs> what is this? Yes, thank you. So we're gonna make a new Google Ads account. Now, there is a problem that we need to get around, and it's called... Copyright. Copyright. There it is! <laughs> I was gonna say, that was my first question when I saw this as a concept. How are you gonna do this? I have a feeling if the moment that they... The that they have to look look and review the ad, they might have a problem with it if it is including the song. Yep. So I have a very special solution to that. Uh-oh. And that's called making our own video. If we just go into an editor here, now this is the actual song, but we yep. need to make this a little bit shorter. This way it avoids any kind of copyright. We should probably cut it off at like maybe the 15 second mark, because this way they can make it like non-skippable. No skips. But then again, I want to end it off at a good point where it makes sense. Like, isn't fair use something? Like, uh, uh, you know, whatever. YouTube I definitely grant- YouTube doesn't believe in fair use you could be criticized blah 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 they believe in fair use so long as the person who owns copyright is willing to grant it so sometimes it works right because they'll flag it and then you tell the person who owns it hey i think this is fair use i think i'm adding to this i'm critiquing it i'm not replacing it you'd have to go back and watch or listen to the original to get the right context and then uh you know, the person who owns the copyright gets to decide, and that person is not a lawyer or a professional in law, gets to decide, yeah, I agree with you, or nah, I don't. That's why the system's broken, but it's really more copyright law than anything. Fair use needs to be a lot more clear as to what it is so that YouTube doesn't have to rely on the copyright holders to determine what fair use is. Honestly, it should be pretty simple, right? Fair use is if you're not taking away from this source like whoever owns the copyright doesn't lose money from what you're doing and what you're doing is different than what they did enough that you couldn't replace the original with it that that that's what fair use is defined as so it seems like we have a good a good definition but for some reason that's not clear enough so we need to somehow make it more clear in this space of youtube like 15 seconds at a time uh, without some sort of pause for commentary, right? It needs to be that black and white, apparently, for dinguses to get it. So it'd be like, if it plays no more than 15 or 30 seconds of the material before a pause, then it's fair use. That's how specific we're going to have to get this before it's fixed. It's not YouTube's problem, really. It's just the law's problem. Graduated lawyer school. So I know what I'm talking about. Yeah, lawyer school. <laughs> All right, so now we're getting that done. Okay, so in order to do this, we need to actually upload this video to YouTube. So, <laughs> this is a great idea. I must just leave it as that, to be honest Rick with you. Rulad. That seems like it's gonna work. Rick this Rulad. just seems so unnatural. Uh, there we go. 
Great. Um, automatically play before, during, after YouTube videos? Yes, we want that. That's basically gonna be like playing so you have like a, you know, in the- before you watch the video. Where do you want your ad to appear? On YouTube and, you know, only on YouTube. Consider using a- well, I considered it and I decided no. Alright, United <laughs> States. Now it's already I telling us- I considered using a business website. I- no. How many people we're gonna get with this? 10 to 20,000 impressions. And impressions count each time your ad is shown. Well, we're gonna need a lot more than that. Gender unknown. Other. Parent, definitely parents. Um, is it gonna let us customize our budget? Like, oh, you cannot pay a certain amount of money. We know you don't have this much. Um, okay. <laughs> reach people. This is a th we don't need to worry about anything about who it's gonna reach. It doesn't matter. All Rick rolls are born equal. And that's something <laughs> that you need to. That's like one of the most questions. Uh, you know, that's definitely the most one of the most important life. Man, this man's train of thought sounds like mine questions if I could just speak correctly. And I do believe, if I'm not mistaken, that Aristotle put forth the question. That seems legit. First, <laughs> daily budget. So let's just toss around some numbers here. $200, uh, okay, that's definitely an improvement. We're only gonna pay for one day, for sure. If we add one more zero on there, it's gonna look like... <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> That is pretty good. That's pretty expensive. Uh, how about if we just do, oh, I don't know, $1,000 seems pretty good. 1.3 million impressions. Uh, 420,000 views, I like that number. 420. I really hope that this works. It's serendipitous. If it says 420K, drop the grand, bro. Drop the grand. Of course, with Google ads, you never know how long it'll take before things start to kick off. They also take that budget and, uh, They'll make it that they'll try to make it be that way by the end of a month. So sometimes they'll use way more than your daily budget in the first couple days and then just like stop. Uh, I know this because I've done advertisements on Google before uh, for various different things and um, helped other people set up ads and it gets like the Wild West. You have to think of daily budget in a 30 day uh mindset how much can you pay in a month because they might take out that whole month in the first week and then just stop pushing it it is just so weird how how they'll how they'll do it i don't highly recommend uh google ads as a very successful way to move traffic unless you have a very targeted localized demographic you're after and in that case you're probably better off on a facebook ad or instagram ad or something like that it, it's just not where you would expect it to be with Google being le legitimately like an ad company. That's what Google is. Uh, and it, it, for someone just coming in and buying ad space, it really, it's, I don't recommend it. Um, I'm sure they don't care as long as they get money. Congrats, you're all done. We'll review your campaign usually within an hour. After it's approved, you can edit your campaign, check its progress. <laughs> no one on earth has ever tried something so stupid. I'm sure someone has. Just everyone. Someone has to have tried this. Something this dumb. Everyone on YouTube, everyone's just watching YouTube and then all of a sudden they just see an ad of just nothing but never gonna give you up. I mean, that's just, perfect. They'll, they'll just wait like, okay. So where's where's the point? Like where's the punchline of this ad? That is the punchline. That's the point. He's always the point. He's never gonna give you up. Ad. Okay. So this is probably gonna get a lot of views because it's like you only pay if someone watches the whole thing or 30 seconds. Which is like I guess that means it's it's because that's just how you get the most views. You, you just make the the shortest but yet most uninteresting ad ever. So that's like That's what you gotta do. So you don't have to pay for the views. <laughs> so short that they they couldn't possibly skip it. That's uh, the big brain strategy. They're just like, okay. But it's also so uninteresting that they couldn't they would never want to click it because it's just like, what was the point of that? <laughs> this is great. Well, I mean, that'll work at getting more people to see it, but I don't know if it'll work in pushing the product, but I see where he's going. I'll see you in a couple hours, I guess. <laughs> Goodbye. It'll probably be longer than that, but all right. Day two. All right, so I'm going to check up on how good the advertisement did. Hopefully it was even approved, because otherwise I just 
waited overnight for absolutely no reason. I'm literally looking at this for the first time. Refreshing it right now. We're just gonna see how this did. If they denied it, I'm gonna be so freaking. That'd be. Oh my god. Yep, there they go. He's already spent $1,500. He said 577,000 views and 5.23 million impressions. <laughs> I feel like this classifies as a thumbnail moment. Hey, let's get into here. Da -na 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 -na. Where, where am I going to be? Where am I going to be? Let's let's look at the ad with them as well. Like That's right. We have thumbnail moments on this channel now. Well, uh, how do you like the thumbnail moment? If you like the thumbnail moment, uh, let me know to keep it going in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe, blah, blah, blah. Here we go. Live reaction. Well, you spent $1,500, my guy. Say goodbye to that money. Goodbye, money. <laughs> Wait, what? Of course, this has 3.3 million views. You made that back and then some, so you, you good. Five. Hello, money. Five. How much did this cost? One. Th <laughs> what? What? Five hundred thousand views? No way. What? Wait, for real? That's more than what I wanted to pay. No, <laughs> fifteen hundred bucks. Five point two. No. Sorry. 5.1 M impressions? Rickroll ad. My account is suspended. I, I said only a thousand. <laughs> they suspended his account already because it's just a Rickroll. <laughs> Got him. Thousand dollars. What are you blind? Are you serious? I didn't even realize to check the actual video. <laughs> 308. Well, that's not 500,000 views, but still, what the actual crap? What? 20, how does it, it has 27 likes. Let me see, let me read some of the comments. Yes, this is why I uninstalled Adblock. This is why I uninstalled Rickroll. Adblock. <laughs> LOL, haha. -ha. Rickroll you made some buy an happy. ad? That's right. <laughs> Rickroll, I can't buy an ad? <laughs> oh, this went splendidly. I believe this video has 300, I cannot believe this video has 300,000 views. This it account sure is does. suspended. Uh, I was not allowed to do that, apparently. 5.1 M impressions? That means, so, is, does that mean how much people, like, saw the ad? Because what's the difference between impressions and views? Like It just depends on how long they stuck around. A view doesn't count until a certain amount of time. Impression means they put it there. They might have closed their whole browser as soon as it popped up, like, instantly or whatever. Like, th there you go. So, like, they saw it, but they skipped or something? Because that's there what it go. says, there's a skip button. There you go. You got it. So that means we, so we rickrolled five million people. Yeah. No, no, wait. Yeah, you did. Wait, really? You sure did. I have to find this ad right now. Now that I think about it, like I'm literally going to have to, like, a few moments later. Well, it's kind of like how am I supposed to find? It? I didn't. Yeah, I, I didn't was gonna put say. Any I was gonna say, how are you going to find your own ad? They, you literally said that it could go anywhere, plus your account suspended, so they're probably not running the ad anymore, plus your campaign was paused, so they're definitely not running the ad anymore. You ain't finding that ad. Specific topics in there, I made it as broad as possible. Okay, so this is the graph. So... Wow, what the f What the fudge, dude? Look at this. That's so crazy. It's still going on. This is just a couple of hours. It's still going. So... Lots of things aren't adding up. It's saying, oh, not illegible, because it's, and, and, but then it's saying enabled. <laughs> but then it's saying, oh, your account is suspended. But then it's saying, oh, it's still going. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> it's still getting views right now. They're taking your money one way or the other. Who knows? Oh, look at these live views, bro. Are you insane? I just wanted to show you the ad on mobile because I found it finally after looking through a whole bunch of videos. And here it is. Uh, he had to mute it. They copyright claimed this video because of that little clip. So, see, see, that's what fair use is. That is clearly fair use. That little clip that he tried to show that he had to mute in post-production, you know, after he uploaded it to YouTube, he probably had to dispute it and they denied his dispute. So then he had to just mute the segment. That's where it's broken. You took that to court. If you were petty enough, you win. 10 times out of 10, you win that case. But why?
no one's going to spend the money. You'd spend more money winning than on the case itself. Until there's like a giant ass class action lawsuit about fair use, this shit's not going to change uh, because they need to rewrite the laws. And they're not going to rewrite the laws until there's a class action lawsuit so fucking big that the court system's like, well, damn, we got to do something about this. <laughs> Like, I guess this worked out because this was just a random video I clicked and now it's showing up. All right, well that's me. I guess that's how you rickroll everyone on YouTube using just a paid advertisement. Uh, and it's just right here, I have it paused. I think I should probably have this like framed. We got five million sure. people rickrolled for at for least sure. five seconds. That's pretty good if you ask me, so. Oh good yeah, work. by the way, uh, this... The video got taken down now apparently. Yep, copyright. Because it violated YouTube's policy on copyright on copyright like what what is it with youtube and these vague messages it's kind of important for me to understand what the heck just happened your account yeah. is suspended we've detected suspicious payments on your account so I, I look up okay so what is it about and it's like well we don't know but your your account is suspended <laughs> <laughs> apparently you're not allowed to just rickroll people with a youtube yeah, app <laughs> well at least not. we got uh, over five hundred thousand. we check out we today's sponsor which is as usual the button about two inches below the screen and all you That's need to do is just make it gray Look if it's that. red. Do the same on my video. Or any other color out of the rainbow that's not gray. And then yeah, you'll get 10 years of good luck if you do that. Yeah, we got 10 so years I'll of good luck. So I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. If you subscribe to my channel, it's 20 years of good luck. So do the right thing. Also subscribe to this guy's channel. Link to the original videos are always in the description of my videos. I hope you enjoyed that. What'd you think? Uh, don't forget to comment below all the things I told you to comment below, including if you like the thumbnail segment of the video. And until we explore again, I'll see you later.